We're here. Far out. Yeah. Come on. place where I've spent many of my years. What? What's going on? You're a doctor. I'm out of options. Doctor? I'm just a med student. You sat in on surgeries. I told you it was scary. More like groovy. Let's go inside. Wait, you don't know what happened here. This used to be a mental hospital. For kids. It was? Yeah, they used to lock kids up here and give them lobotomies. Wait. Be careful. Come on, mister. I'm not a doctor. What the hell would you want with me? Like I said, I'm out of options. I don't know what's wrong with me. But I can tell you one thing. I hate myself. I mean, I hate a part of myself. Oh my God. <laughs> I know you. You were that electrician guy. Yeah, you were fixing the lights at the school's hospital. Lee Stevens. Yeah, we've met Natalie, remember? I told you how I admired your talent. Yeah. I, I thought you were just some asshole hitting on me. I didn't know you were gonna kidnap me. Somebody's here. Let's go check it out. No, don't. I'll go. You stay here. Stay. Tell me, Natalie. Did they ever teach you in med school about Body Integrity Identity Disorder. I've barely seen how they remove tonsils. It's a condition. A condition where someone doesn't feel quite right with their body. Well, why didn't you just tell me, Mr. Stevens? What? I knew you were flirting with me that day at the hospital. You didn't need to deceive me, Mr. Stevens. I'm a grown woman. But, um, I, I, uh...
here! Hey, you're not going anywhere. Fuck you, Lee, I've had enough of this. No, we're out of time. I need you to fix me. I need this abomination off my body. What the hell are you talking about? My condition, my leg, my leg. I've tried to live with it, really I have. I can't get it out of my head. I need it off my body now. What? You want me to cut off your leg using a rusty saw? I want you to cut it off. I just need you to stitch up the stump. Stump. After all, I've done it before.